Time for Potentially Yours. Every Tuesday, we try and give pets at Dane County Humane Society a new place to call home. And Gail is here with Rosie. Rosie, and she's a little anxious and a little I'm nervous. Scared. So we're Horse. just going to hold yeah. her a little bit. But she is a sweetheart. She was just making noise all the way here, saying hello to everyone. She's that mm -hmm. beautiful white and kind of calico markings. Okay, mm -hmm. I'll let you go, but I know you're going to jump on me. Stay <laughs> here. But really sweet cat and sadly came in with two other cats. The owner lost her house, and so oh. she wasn't able to keep her pets. So they came into us, but from what we've been able to tell, they don't seem to be too bonded, so they don't need to go home together. But if people are looking for two cats, um, one of them already mm -hmm. got adopted, but Rosie and her buddy are still available. Um, but when I was at the shelter this morning, she crawled right into my lap and was just rolling around. I mean, definitely a very social, outgoing cat mm -hmm. that just wants to find that right home, that right kind of comfort place that she can really just open up and be herself mm -hmm. and enjoy the good life. And it's hard to do that on TV. Yet. It is. It's yeah. a little stressful sometimes. She's doing a good job. She's I know. Great. She just wants to hang out. So but, she was around mm. other cats. Yes. You don't know about any dogs or kids. You or know, anything we've heard that she's not a big fan of other dogs. So I think okay. other cat siblings would be really mm -hmm. fun for her, but she also would be great on her own. But I think yeah. dogs can be a little overwhelming. So definitely a uh, Probably not a puppy. And you said family. that she's about four. Yeah, right. Four so and a half. You're past that, you know, spunky that kitten, kitten stage. Getting into everything so. stage. She's really mm -hmm. kind of going to just melt right into that home and become that really nice pet. So she's she's a great one. And we have some awesome adult cats. We're going to come up into kitten season sooner oh, than later. So right. let's get these sweet adult ones, really good home. She's fantastic. So let's talk about Joey from last week, the jo guinea pig. Oh my gosh, I love that guinea pig. He is cool I miss the and guinea pig. handsome yeah. and uh, he Look just at, hi, loved to munch on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he was just eating carrots He's like, yeah, this is cool. He is week. such a cool guinea pig and he mm -hmm. is still available. So come and give that sweet boy a chance. Mm. Oh, I love that guy. Okay, you've got an event coming Yeah, well, here. Fontana Sports is hosting Cinco de Fido. So instead of Cinco de Mayo, <laughs> Cinco de Fido is <laughs> next Tuesday, good. May 5th, mm -hmm. and it's at Lake Farm Park. And it's a fundraiser to, um, part of the proceeds go to help the animals at the Humane Society. So it's a one mile and a 5K walk run. Um, so register today, go to our website for more information on that. and. We'll see you mm. out next Tuesday. And speaking of your, your events, last mm. week you had the microchipping event, which was, oh, uh, we just got a note this morning, 129 pets. Yes, That's awesome. we were so happy to have yeah. a huge turnout. And for people to know they can always bring their pet in. Um, it's a little bit higher price, but still very reasonable and a mm. great way to keep your pet safe. Oh, it is so worth it. It, yeah. is. it is so Cats worth it. Cats and dogs it. get out of those doors really fast. And yeah. microchipping and tags are so important. Um, how's the cat capacity going on at the shelter right you now? You know, we're doing pretty good, knock on wood. Yeah, that uh, we're pretty good we, on our dogs and cats, but we know coming into the spring and summer, we yep. start to see an increase. So, yeah. doing good now, and that's a, a huge part to the community for coming out and adopting. We're such a great community we live in. So, yeah. thanks to everybody and come and get this sweet, Aww. sweet lady yeah. a chance. Yeah. I know. Come and adopt her. She's so nice. I like yes. her. Wow. All right, good Gail. Girl. Thank you. Thank very you much. both. Great thanks, to see Rosie. you. Right, if you're interested Bye. in adopting or checking out other animals at Dane County Humane Society, there's plenty to choose from. Go to GiveShelter.org or set up an appointment at 838-0413. As we head to break, let's take a look at two animals who are available now at Green County Humane Society. We'll check on traffic with Pat Gallagher when News 3 This Morning comes right back.